Wow, yeah, swear to God I'm with it. I don't see nobody in my lane. It's quite go get it like me. Wow, please don't be wasting my time with that business. Who are you kidding, man? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sports yeah. Wow. against the dangerous Arlison. São 40 lutas, venceu 36 vezes, 23 por nocaute, 4 derrotas. Ele é. Macaco, Gabriel Macaco is looking to e get on the ladder vermelho. and to Divitória come on tonight Espírito and show that he Santo, can win. Of course, Macaco was his nickname. It means monkey. São 35 anos, 1 metro e 81. Também destro. Três lutas, duas vitórias, uma por nocaute, uma derrota. Ele é Gabriel Macaco. Here we go, the experienced Arlison versus the up and coming hungry Gabriel Macaco. Arlison in the blue gloves, Macaco in the red. This is the first of three rounds, three minutes each. Look for Arlison to try to use his knockout power here early. Makako is known to be very versatile. He'll try to mix things up and keep Arlison on his toes. See Makako in there trying to mix it up with his kicks. Or sorry, Arlison. Makako is much bigger, than, well not much bigger, but he's got, definitely got a reach advantage over Arlison here. Broke his, I think he fractured his ankle or broke his ankle there. Simple kick to the legs and Arlison checked it and Makaka goes down and that is the fight. That's it. He is done. Ooh, that is brutal looking. Oh yeah, that is a broken leg. Ah, that's a horrible thing to see. You hate to see a fighter go down like that. You hate to see a fighter lose from a checked kick. But that is just what happened there. Tough break. Oof. Oh, I hate to be punning it, but tough break for Gabriel Macaco. Oh, that looks painful. Give the guy some drugs before you do that. Oh. 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 And that is it. Your winner, Arlison Tenchidan. Winning, uh, putting another notch in his belt. Tough way to win, but that's it. Simple checked kick. He does not look happy about winning that way. He looks like he is upset. I wonder if he's upset because he feels bad or if he wanted something more. He looks like he's upset for having hurt the other guy, which it's strange because that's his job. I don't. I don't get it. Anyways, your winner, Arlison Tenchiran. Oh, brutal! Oh, brutal! Oh, that's not it. That wasn't blocked. There it is. There it is. Checked. Perfect timing on the check there. Man, you can see Arlison feels bad about it. That's not how he wanted to win.
Of course, you see that sometimes. The great Anderson Silva lost that way. Not a way you want to see any fighter go down and lose here. Tough break for Gabriel Makako Siqueira. He was really hoping to come in here and prove that he belongs in this division and to start to make his way up the ladder. We wish him well on his road to recovery and hopefully he'll be back here with the WGP fighting soon. Remember, you can follow us on Facebook or like us at WGP Kickboxing. You can follow us on Twitter at WGP Kickboxing or on Instagram at WGP Kickboxing. And that is it for the second of 10 fights tonight. Later on, we have our Challenger GP Tournament Super Middleweight Division. A super middleweight, super middleweight Championship bout for our co-main event and our main event, a WGP Kickboxing Heavyweight chat title on the line. Until then, let's keep watching this guy break his leg. Ah, brutal. He knew instantly that it was broken. Uh, tough break. Coming up later, our Challenger GP a tournament. Uh, four men, one night, three fights. Adolfo Cavallo versus Marcus John Jones in our first semifinal. Our second semifinal, Victor Valenzuela versus Sebastian Dominguez. Four fantastic fighters looking to become the next super middleweight division title contender. And then after that, Diego Gaucho, the super middleweight champ, will defend his belt versus Fernando Nonato. And finally, to end the night, our 10th and final fight, champion, heavyweight champion, Felipe Micheletti, will fight Jaime Moraes the second. More great fights to come soon. You see, Arlison feels really horrible about doing that. Unavoidable. One of those things.
Tough break there for Gabriel Makaka. They are strapping him in. Tying him up, making sure that he doesn't move that leg. Tough break. We wish good things for Gabriel Makaka, a fast recovery, and hopefully he will be back on his feet in no time and back to training, and we can see him soon here again at the WGP. We want to see him do well. In the meantime, we have some great fights coming up next. Uh, in our very next fight, Mateos Gatti versus Lucas Almeida. Almeida, a light middleweight fight between two very savage fighters. After that, we have our tournament with Adolfo Cavallo versus Marcus John Jones, followed by Sebastian Dominguez versus Victor Valenzuela. And after that, we'll have our championship bouts. Diego Gaucho versus Fernando Monato. And Jaime Moraes will take on ch current champion Felipe Micheletti. Nice show of sportsmanship there from uh, Arlison. You can see he felt really bad about that. A sensational show of sportsmanship. Something you, that is unseen around the world. Second to none here in Brazil and in South America. Incredible sportsmanship. And that is it for the second fight. Let's go to the ring for the official decision. Bem, por razões óbvias, diante do acidente que ocorreu aqui no ringue, não há dúvidas. Vence! Alisson Tenchiran! Winner by TKO in the first round.